fellas. Let's get them pumped. Like and subscribe. Real Murder TV. Okay, guys, I want to get into something that we don't never talk about when some of these guys die and, and some of the things these people do and the positive thing and stuff like that. Um, e Day, you know what I'm saying, never really get caught lacking because. He was always on point. You can see some of the video, the old Zach TV video, he was always on point. He knew what he was in and what he was doing, and he knew what people wanted him. Um, like Breezy and all said, he felt comfortable because he thought that he was messing with a girl in an area that he really didn't have no ops. But you gotta understand, a lot of you guys hide out in other people's neighborhoods and around other people. You know, they know somebody, they know somebody. It's a lot of people that wanna be a gangster that can call up somebody at any second. And they would come get you. It was it was a said that two people, you know what I'm saying? The witness said she saw two people get out of a car and shoot E Day 22 times, man. And, oh, he was shot 22 times, man. It wasn't no way of surviving. And they got back into the car. And they shot him 22 times. It kind of like it was sending a message for like C Day or something. C Day is called C Day 22. But they jumped back into a gold SUV and got away. But what we ain't been talking about is that what E Day did when he when he was shot 22 times. A lot of people would have gave up and did this and did that or shield you and this and that. A lady got dropped off at a place over there and she was coming out. E Day pushed her out the way, saved her life. She would have been hit. Cause they shot, they were shooting a lot over there. He saved her life, she said. She was able to get under the car and then get touched. E Day died on the scene. Rest in peace, E-Day.